She was said to be a rather promiscuous dancer. Ah. Uh. I'm not going to touch any missions for the time being. Uh, just in Are case. Are you going to use her for a while? I'm going to finish the ones I'm using first. You may use the Matama if it pleases you. Okay, so the Viper Queen mission will be the next mission. Viper Queen is really cool. Generally an easy fight. So we got recovery stock plus one, which is amazing. Diffusion stock plus one, which is irrelevant. Because it's not our main slot. Let's buy all the Tenko snacks. The only reason we spend money with that guy is because, more or less, the more money we spend, the better stock he eventually gets. Infer Inferno Warbow. That looks fun. Yeah. I don't know if that's what we want to get right away. Let's see what the armor is. I know, I'm just like. saying it looks fun. So I really want to get... Snow cap gear, so it's lighter. We need to fight Welcome more blood hunters. Uh, still don't have a harrow half horn bit to make the heavy helmet. What's the sword fighter gear? Is it any good? Um. It's not bad. It's just the snow cap. Actually, the snow cap gear might weigh more. Yeah, the change is on the side, so we don't want the snow cap, actually. Okay, so that is lighter. We're still fat rolling, though. That's 28. Okay, the, the weight shift is a little bit weird. But anyway. Uh, the Sword Fighter set is from the Terror Grinder. And we're missing Drill Tooth and Horn Bit for it. But it's got this, like, sweet uh, Jingasa style hat. It's not. Well, it's more like a. Uh, what's the word? It's it's there's a couple kind of casa. This is not necessarily a gene casa. It's, it's, it's not a sando casa either. I can't remember what the specific one is, but anyway, it looks pretty sweet. Uh, this is the chess piece. It's like a uh, monk wrap. The gloves are very spiky, and then the hakama are pretty plain. I think we will make the Inferno Warbo. Even though I don't necessarily like bows. It's probably going to work out better for us. And we can change it. Like, if we know what kind of mission we're getting into and we don't want the bow, we can change it. Once again, we're hoping that Hayatori is not present in the bath, because he throws us out. And of course, it's Hayatori for like the third time. If we come in the bath enough, he'll eventually accept us. I don't feel that this is one of those times, though. Hopefully the pool has mercy and still grants me a boon. Uh, 
Tenko lunchbox. We're going to send the Tenko back to the Age of Yore. Because that's where the boss fight is. We haven't finished enough quests to get any more mail. You've got mail. It's a really awful blonde joke about that. See, I don't want, to, don't want to pick it up until we finish something else, but it's a really good quest. Right, so Blonde comes out, checks her mailbox, slams the lid down, stomps back into the house. This happens a few times. Then uh, her neighbor asks, what's the problem? She's like, my stupid new computer keeps telling me I have mail. good. Pretty savage even. Magical mirror on the wall. <laughs> hey, this is the Viper Queen. Uh, she's actually a snail. Don't tell her that. She's also she's got like a bitch. She's also got a snaky vagina. Snaky vagina. You've got a snaky vagina. It's not a transplant. You've got venom flaps. So I'm just going to keep being the Christ out of it, and if she gets in my grill, I'm just going to make a black hole and then teleport away. The hole of the black variety? To take her black cherry, but only with permission. It's a good robot chicken joke. It was strawberry shortcake themed. And there, there was a joke involving, I think she's called black cherry pie. <laughs> That's terrible. And then this guy, whose name I can't remember because they're all like fruit confections, is like, I've never taken anyone's black cherry without their express permission. Anyway, I thought I saw my tanko, so I ran over, but it wasn't so. So the shell um, can regrow fully, like it'll become a physical shell that we have to purify. There, under the shell, there's another breakable part. Really? Yes. And the reason I'm purifying is just to get a little bit quicker stamina recovery. Okay, something broke off. One of her arms. I always feel like I'm not breaking the boss. Like I'm not doing my part to break the boss when I'm using a ranged weapon. Okay, shell's off. So I'm going to abort that maneuver. Okay, she reabsorbed the shell, like, instantly. Or it's just gone. No, she got it back. That was quick. So those two parts Extra that broke... quick. Yeah, those two parts that just broke off, she got them both back. Damn.
Okay, broke tentacle off. Drop a sanctum for safety. Even though I'm still convinced it's useless. What, sanctum? Yeah. Bow seems pretty good from what I'm from watching it at least. For bosses, it's great. Multiple hitboxes, they don't move around too much. For normal enemies, piss. Piss and shit all over the place? Well, normal enemies don't have enough HP. I'm gonna drop it. She's stuck in a singularity and a stupor. Nice fucking meme. Okay, while well, she's staggered, I'm gonna have everyone follow me. And I'm going to release the the uh, group breaker when she recovers from being staggered, thus staggering her again. You can build up a lot of breaker with ranged attacks, but you have to manually aim for the actual breaker shot. So it's not so good. Here we're purifying the second shell. We got a voice of regret this time. Still has an arm we need to break. Yeah, the black hole from Paradox is super good against this particular enemy. And just to have Hayatori drop stupor on top for a long duration stun. Why well, shouldn't like Hayatori? Now, Hayatori is one of my favorite uh, companions. Just fails at farming. He also keeps trying to touch your uh, Tenko appropriately. Yeah, but we don't take our private matters on the battlefield. So we're on the third shell, and still haven't broken that first arm. HP is getting a bit low. I'm slightly concerned. So uh, she also has a water attack, which was demonstrated just then. Alright, so, arm came off, and we destroyed another shell. What the, sh what the shell? Alright. Ideally, for using a bow, you'd want a Mitama that gives you faster stamina recovery. Uh, this one doesn't, but Paradox is still really good for spacing out the enemy. Well, yeah. I mean, sometimes good enough is exactly that, good enough. We're on, like, shell four now? As I said, Bomb they're shells. legit shells. Burning shell. Ah, we popped it off just before killing her. Excellent. Got Himiko. Loot the place blind. Alright, that'll be that. We should enjoy yet another cutscene after this. You never bitch about additional cutscenes, that's for sure. You must unlock additional cutscenes. Oh god. And I think that uh, Mami Tama leveled up again from that fight. Should also get new weapons and armor from this.
No rare item. No horn bit. Fugaku may be the best choice for horn bits. Hatsuho is the only one who continues to sleep. We, we, we know why she might not want to wake up. <laughs> 